What up, people? What up? What up? It's your man Rajay. See that thing that she there, baby? She there. Like swimwear. All right, just a quick video. This ain't really about nothing. I'm just trying to give us quick updates, trying to get some stuff together in here. I'm all over the place. I wasn't doing no unboxing thing. You know what I mean? It was just, you know, y'all seen it's a thousand um, unboxings on YouTube. But <clears throat> I did get the radio. So I got the San Juan in M17 popping. I did a little adjustments real quick. It's a lot of adjustments. So you can see I put the wheel. That's 10 degrees. Cocked her out some. I like that feel of it. That was pretty good. I put this screen protector that they come with um, on there. But I don't really like it. I might take that off. Because it kind of seems like it dulls out the screen a little bit to me. But um, I don't know. The lanyard, I put the lanyard thing on there. And you know what's crazy? I, I had a thousand lanyards around here, and I can't even find one of them. I'm hurting for lanyards. It's crazy. So I got to get some lanyards. It's just like a shoestring joint. Well, I mean, it would work, but I got to get a lanyard. So, I'm in here um, bonding up the radios. Um, <clears throat> this particular system, I got came with um, two. Let me tell you. I opt to get two, um, the 493 receivers instead of the, it usually come with one receiver and one battery, stock battery. Um, because I know I'm, I already ordered the upgraded battery, the 5,500 milliamp battery. I opt not to get the battery and get another one of these. So I got two, I'm running two 493 receivers. I got one already in there in that tray. I'm putting this one in the truggy. That one's already in the buggy. This battery, shout out to my man CJ, test the tune Capadre. This is stock battery, because he said, I know you won't want to play, so until your battery come in, he hook me up with that real quick. That way I can lease, turn it on, and you know, get accustomed to old girl. See how that screen protector, it seemed like it, I mean, I can see it, don't get me wrong, I can see it, right? I can definitely see it. But it just seemed like it like dulls it out or something. I don't know. The biggest thing is trying to get used to um, this touchscreen deal, which is uh, it's okay. It's just something different to get used to. Um, so I got this one bonded up and all foamed in there and all good, baby. Yeah, I ain't got nothing on it, but yeah so she's good to go so far so good i gotta set like um let me get that off real quick Ugh. i gotta set like endpoints and stuff but for the most part this thing is good it's just um i guess just trying to get used to you know this the system the way it works um it's not bad though it's not bad it's, it's pretty good see just trying to get used to it. That's all. But it works good. I keep wanting to touch this screen. Like, this is a touch screen. That's probably going to be the newest thing when they um come out. This will all be touch screen. But I got to just get used to that. Stuff like that. But uh, otherwise, that, people, it's working. It's working good. So, that's the new system. Um, what else? <clears throat> I did a video and I was showing some products. This is the Send It Tool Stand. Y'all can see that. But listen, this is like a prototype. All right. The stands would be like this. It'd probably be less holes because what happened was these holes are too small. They fit these tools, but they don't fit like, uh, hold on me. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm a little messy because I'm just in here like getting stuff together. But they don't fit the MIPs or the Sended tools. They made the holes too small, so they got to go back. But this is prototype. This is coming out soon. Don't worry about them. Y'all get it. It ain't going to be like this. But this is just prototype and testing. So I'll just do something in there. Get a little wicky winky. You know what I mean? Nothing really crazy. But but it's popping. They good. They decent. They pretty good. Also, these are coming out here. Descended um, wheel wrenches. Nice, right? 17 millimeter. They coming out. They look nice. You know, uh, also, hold on. Give me one second, people. Same wine thing comes with 
course your manual. This is an updated sheet. And see, this says version 1.6. I don't know about that, but this is um, on the box. This is the version 1.01.10. So, and I checked it. It is. So, I guess this is old. But this is a correction for the user manual. It come with some stickers. Stuff like that. How to set certain stuff up. They come with a boatload of stuff. Um, new wheel. Some grips. Come with some, um, there it is, yeah. there it is. Some, uh, yeah, that's some wheel. Come with some springs for your throttle and trigger. Different, um, tension springs. Um, different, uh, trigger sizes. Like I said, you can angle this out this way, straight or back, however you want to do it. It's a lot of adjustments to this thing. I will say that. Um, but it's so far, so good. So far, it's been, um, no problems. I mean, I'm just waiting to get some warmer weather because right now we up here freezing up north, man. It's like freezing cold. So that's pretty decent. Um, I was going to show you. Oh, hold on. Let me get this out real quick. All right. I'll show you all these bearings, too. That's coming out. Um, where they at? Where they at? Uh, I need one of them. All right. <clears throat> all right. These, let me, let me make sure I get the right ones. Yeah, okay, yeah. Sorry, I'm trying to do this one hand in real quick. All right, these bearings, if I can get this off. Hold on, y'all. All right, these bearings right here, these coming out. These ones here, are, they're ceramic, they're like hybrid. Cause ceramic, it spins faster, less resistance. But they are fragile. The balls are fragile. But these ones will so be a hybrid one. <clears throat> that's um, it's will be stronger. But they're ceramic, and they'll go in throughout the whole car. Um, they coming out with from Send It. So this will be pretty good. I gotta do some testing with them. I'm putting them back in the car to do some testing once I can uh, get things popping. You know what I mean? Just a little too cold right now. So that's about. Oh, let me show y'all this. God, it's messy in here, man. I don't like my stuff all unorganized. I'm a very organized person. But, all right, this is... I did a video about this engine. I told you I was rebuilding this one. This is the uh, No Raw C Manifesto, right? And I told you I was rebuilding this thing. Y'all see the head, Manifesto. All right, so I found out what was wrong with it with the button head. So I got a new button head. We get a part number. That's the part number, 28136. New button head, O-ring. Um, also got some new shims for that bad boy head shims, if you're inclined, all right? That's the part number for 10 millimeter, 0 0.10 millimeter, that's 03011. That's the part number for the 0 0.20 millimeter head shims, 03013, okay, head shims. Novi. So I still was able to get some Novi. So this thing gonna be back up and running soon. Good to go. Also sent out a couple engines. My Palomas, my um, blue hair Paloma. Sent that out to get done over. Um, that red R5R. A couple other ones. Just trying to get <clears throat> set up for the season. M3X still running strong and good. No issues. No issues. No issues. Uh, the Maxi, still great, running good. Actually, I took this apart. Pinch is still crazy on it. Because I was sending out stuff to get done over and freshed up. And I was going to send this out. Because I said, well, let me make sure it ain't needing a refresh. But phew, there's nothing wrong with it. So, I put it back together. She good to go. Back in the truck, she go. Or buggy. Oops. She's good to go there. All right, good people. This was just something quick and easy I wanted to show y'all. Um, <clears throat> right now, I'm planning on banking down Phil Hurd for the race for the Colonial Winter Classic. That's at the end of February. That's the 18th to the 21st. Don't forget about Sundancers, uh, 13th to the 14th. 
in uh, Southside. That's the end of March. I think it's like 27, 28, somewhere in like that. But look all them races up on Facebook. Get the official dates. Um, and come on out. I'm trying to make at least two of them. You know what I mean? At least two of them. Feel her right now. I'm, I'm banking on rolling. Unless something happens, comes up. But otherwise, then I'm, I'm going down there. All right. Um, also, let me tell y'all. I'm going to start doing videos announcing races. Because apparently that's like a big thing. Where people, I'm getting a lot of messages like people, I didn't even know that track was there until you did a video or I didn't know that race was there or whatever. So, I'm putting my email address, okay? And if you got a race promoter, whatever, send me the details to that email address and send me the flyer. And then I'll do a video. I ain't charging nobody, nothing like that. I'm just trying to get the word out. We got a race the way it might be in your town. Don't matter where it's at. Just holler at me. That way I can put it out there. Um, yeah, that way I can just put it out there. Because apparently a lot of people watch these videos and they didn't know certain things. It's, it's crazy. But So that's why I'm going to be my new thing now. I'm going to start doing videos just announcing races. Just to get the buzz out. I want to help the track out. And also... That way, you might have didn't know or whatever the case was in your area. You see the video, boom, you know it's in your area, all right? All right. So, this is your man, Raj 11 Come back with a quick one. Just let, showing y'all. I got the thing thing in. Yes, sir. All right, y'all. So, listen, be safe. And I'll see y'all next one. Peace.